In woodworking, a molding plane, molding plane in US spelling is a specialized plane used for making the complex shapes found in wooden moldings. Traditionally, molding planes were blocks of wear-resistant hardwood, often beech or maple, which were worked to the shape of the intended molding. The blade, or iron was likewise formed to the intended molding profile and secured in the body of the plane with a wooden wedge. A traditional cabinet maker's shop might have many, perhaps hundreds, of molding planes for the full range of work to be performed. The late 19th century brought modern types which were all metal affairs such as the American Stanley No. 55 Universal Plane and the English Record No. 405 Multiplane with a wide variety of interchangeable cutters, integral fences, and knickers. Small cutting edges which score the grain fibers when working across the board. Large crown moldings required planes of six or more inches in width, which demanded great strength to push and often had additional peg handles on the sides, allowing the craftsman's apprentice or other worker to pull the plane ahead of the master who guided it. While generally considered outdated, a modern furniture shop doing reproduction or restoration work might keep a collection of molding planes to match original work, or to build in an authentic manner. The earliest known record of a molding plane is a molding plane iron of Roman origin unearthed in Cologne, Germany. In modern industry, the work of the molding plane has been taken up by the electrically powered spindle molder or wood shaper. On a smaller scale, the handheld or table mounted electric router allows the use of interchangeable router bits of a wide variety of profiles and is readily available to the small business or home craftsperson. Notes <laughs> <laughs>